Hey, y'all, and welcome to Royer's Corner. Good morning and happy Monday. Y'all, there was one show that I, well, quite a few actually, but um, two specifically that I truly enjoyed watching every day when I got out of school and had no business watching. One was Jerry Springer, RIP, and the other was Maury Povich and him announcing you are not the father. <laughs> Y'all, well, now Maury has announced that he is going to be providing his own at-home paternity test. So you won't have to come up to the show. You can get your own announcements at your own time. Y'all, happy Monday and welcome to Royer's Corner. Hey, y'all. Welcome to Royer's Corner. If this is your first time, welcome. If not, I'm so glad that you have decided to join me again. Please remember to hit the like button on this video. Comment your thoughts and opinions down below in the comment section so we can keep the conversation going. And if you're not a subscriber, stop what you're doing right now. Hit that subscribe button and that notification bell on all. That way you see each and every time I post a video with you in mind. Well, y'all, the results are in, okay? Period. All righty. So um, shout out to uh, HuffPost. So um, the results are in. Maury Povich announces at home paternity test kit company. OK, so Povich, who retired from his talk show, Maury, last year, said the company's at home test can uh, unite families after a long period of time. All right. So former daytime talk show host Maury Povich is gearing up for his next venture at home paternity test kit. Povich, who retired from his talk show last year, told TMZ on Friday that he is launching a DNA paternity test company called The Results Are In, a not... <laughs> <laughs> this is so funny, y'all. A nod to the phrase he would say on Maury before revealing the paternity test results. Y'all, when I tell y'all, I used to like rush home to take pride and joy in watching the Maury show. And, you know, I used to love the dramatics of it all, the way that people would get up and run off the stage and do all this extraness, like, or when the dads wouldn't be the dad and they would be jumping up and down. And I told you so, I told you so. Like, y'all, they, I mean, that used to be the show, okay? So um, I've been around paternity testing for more than 20 uh, years, so I know exactly what's going on and how we can help those people who are looking for fathers, fathers who are looking for children, fathers who don't think they're the father, and fathers who think they're fathers. Um, Povich told TMZ in a video interview um, this past week, okay? And we can unite families after a long period of time. So I don't know how long this, oh, this is a long video. Um, I retired from doing the original shows. And by the way, they are now in repeats at the same stations they were when we had the original shows on. So I'm still around a lot. But what happened was that after retirement, uh, my business manager, Jonathan Lennox, came to me. He says, you know, I have an idea. I said, what? He says, you are so well known about paternity testing. And we have talked to the DNA Diagnostic Center, DDC, which is the 
So you can go play the rest of that video. I don't want to get struck, y'all. So 30 seconds, that's it. But like he said, his manager came to him and said, you've been doing this for over 20 years. Let's go ahead and, and, and get you certified to have your own DNA test. You know, let's do it, okay? So Popage explained that his business manager approached him with the idea following his retirement, adding that the kids would be... Um, adding that the kits would be through DNA Diagnostic Center, the same company that ran the test with a 99.9% .9 accuracy rate on Maury um, for over two decades. The test, he said, will be sent to the D DDC lab, and within two or three days, people can receive confidential results. So that's a beautiful thing. At least they... I like that he's trying to keep the peace about it. He's trying to keep the same thing that he had a kind of had going on on his show, just without the drama, you know. So at least people are still going to be able to, you know, determine, you know, whether they're the mom or excuse me, whether they're the dad or not in a timely manner. Two to three days, that is really, really good. That's really, really fast, really, really accurate. Um, with court testing, you don't even get it that fast. So for him to be providing something with such a quick turnaround, that's a beautiful thing to me, okay? So uh, the DDC said in a blog post in 2011 that it will be done more than 3,000, that they have done more than 3,000 tests for the show since the beginning, um, working with Maury in 1998. Povich talk show ended last September, but continues to be syndicated. And I catch it every now and then. When I'll be flipping past the TV and I see it, I stop and I watch. Because <laughs> it's just entertaining. It really, really is. Okay. Um, I've seen firsthand how DNA testing can change lives and bring families together, Povich said in a statement to TMZ. What the results are in, we're making it easier and more affordable than ever before people get an answer they need. So this is beautiful. I love that he is not, from what I understand, he's not doing this out of a place of messiness. He's doing this, you know, to really help families and continue on the work that he has done um, these 20 plus years on his show, The Maury Show, y'all. So Shout out to Maury Povich for getting these daddies in the court, getting these daddies in the uh, DNA testing, swiping the mouths, and getting them sent off. Two to three days is an excellent turnaround time, you know, and maybe just maybe even the courts now may use this system to say you can go purchase Maury uh, Povich's, the results are in DNA tests, and bring them to court. This could be a really great turnaround and a positive thing for us as a society, y'all. So shout out to Maury Povich. Shout out to the results are in. I cannot wait till those new DNA tests drop. And maybe, just maybe, people will start doing their own um, videos of releasing, you know, their paternity test. So I'm curious. I am like, you know, ready to see how this is going to work. Um, you know, I, I'm, I, I think this is a great idea. I really, really do. Like I said, I truly enjoyed the Maury show, the way that people would get up and run off stage and just be falling out all over the place. So many people have done reenactments of the Maury show, which have been hilarious. I remember when uh, Tyler Perry did a reenactment with Medea and Mr. Brown and Cora. And, you know, he found they found out that Cora, I think uh, they said that, or uh, Mr. Brown wasn't the father and then Medea went running off and doing all this extraness. So people have been, you know, portraying the show of Maury for years and years and years. And so it's finally nice to see something positive come out of it, that he wants to continue to do the DNA testing to bring families together for fathers to find their children, for children to find their fathers, you know, and for those who really, you know, want to be the father in the life but don't know, they can get those results in a time timely manner and continue going forward in a positive direction. So shout out to Maury Povich. You have created an empire and now it is becoming something even bigger with your own paternity testing. Shout out to you. Well, y'all leave your thoughts and opinions down below in the comment section. Did you watch the Maury show? If so, um, you know, what did you think about the paternity test? You know, uh, situations. Did you think it was a bit dramatic? Did you think it was real? Do you think it was fake? 
personally, I think it was real. Um, and, and, and I just, I, I really, really enjoyed watching, you know, especially when they were the dad and the moms really, you know, did not know. And the dads were happy to find out that that was their children. Those were some of the best episodes ever. Some of the best. Okay. So like I said, y'all leave your thoughts and opinions down below in the comment section so we can keep the conversation going. Hit the like button on this video. And if you're not a subscriber, check out your, check out Royer's World over here. I was going to say, check out your channel. Check out my channel for you as well. And if you like what we got going on, make sure you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell on all. That way you see each and every time I post a video with you in mind. Thank y'all for joining me this morning and I'll catch y'all a little later. Love you. Bye.